Our Northeast India is vibrant. Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Manipur, Meghalaya, Mizoram, Nagaland, Tripura and Sikkim are placed with rich cultural and natural resources. Prime Minister Mr. Narendra Modi used to refer Northeast India as India's natural economic zone. The Northeast India is one of the strategically important parts of our country. Therefore, developing and transforming Northeast is one of the top priorities of our government. Our government is trying to improve the connectivity of these regions to road, rail, telecom, power, waterways and highways. Prime Minister Mr. Narendra Modi has defined Northeast India as India's organic basket and as the gateway to Southeast Asia markets. For the development of Northeast states, connectivity is crucial and it is good to see that Japanese companies are actively participating in the infrastructure development of Northeast India. Japan is the first country which is allowed to invest in the infrastructure in Northeast India, along with other strategically important parts of our country. This is a reflection of trust between our country's leadership. There is a strong cultural connection between India and Japan, and people of both sides have a great respect for each other. Let's take a look at some interesting facts related to Indo-Japan partnership in Northeast India. There is definitely no match to Japanese technology and expertise in high-speed railways, infrastructure and manufacturing. Since Prime Minister Mr. Narendra Modi has come to power, the trust between India and Japan has reached a new height. Last year, Japan has committed $25 billion investment in India. Japanese companies are eager to participate in our key government initiatives. And with each passing year, this trust is becoming stronger. Here I would like to quote the words of Prime Minister of Japan, Mr. Shinzo Abe, that PM Narendra Modi's economic policies are like Shinkan Sen, high speed, safe and reliable, and carrying many people along. A strong India is good for Japan, and a strong Japan is good for India. I am Devsina Mishra, and I believe the future of India-Japan's partnership is truly unlimited.